Hello and welcome to the tutorial on subtraction. In this tutorial we will learn how to subtract a four digit number and hundreds and we're going to do this using the horizontal format. Now this is very simple. Let's begin with our first example. What is 5,000 435 minus 300. So 5,435 minus 300. Now I'm sure some of you are already shouting out the answer, but it's important that we learn the principle behind this. So let's begin with the number we are subtracting, the 300. We've got units and tens. Now both of them are zero. Therefore, the number we are subtracting from the 35 there, that does not change. We are subtracting zero. Okay, so the 35 does not change. Now how about the hundreds? Well, we are subtracting 300. How many hundreds do we have? To begin with, we've got 4. So that's something we can do. 4 minus 3 equals 1. The thousands, over here, the five thousands, that does not change, but only in this example. Okay? So therefore, 5,435 minus 300 is 5,000. 135. The only digit which has changed is the 1. Okay? That's the hundreds. Now let's look at a slightly different example. This time we have 9,027 minus 800. So 9,027 minus 800. Now again, following the same principles, we've got 0, 0, therefore the 27 does not change, okay? It's 27 minus 0, that does not change. Now let's move to the hundreds. We've got 8 hundreds to subtract. How many do we have on the left hand side? We have 0, and that's something we cannot do. So let's look at the thousands column. We've got 90. Now let's do this equation. It's 90 minus 8. Now you should know this. 90 minus 8 is 82. Now I'm saying 90 minus 8. You can actually write down the zeros to make it more clearer. It's actually 9,000 minus 800. Okay, 9,000 minus 800 is 8,200. But that looks a little bit long-winded. I prefer to use the shorter method. So therefore, 9,027 minus 800 is 8,227. Now in this example, both the thousands and the hundreds changed. And where did that H2 come from? It's from our workings over here. So it really is very simple. The subtraction of a four-digit number and hundreds using the horizontal format.